Welcome to Gymodism Total Notary Channel. Today I will teach you how to increase the volume of your microphone, the output volume. So basically, if the people you are talking to have a hard time hearing you, you need to boost the volume of your microphone so that uh, people can hear you better. And uh, to do this, you go down to the right corner of the screen right here. Uh, and right click on this one, uh, you can change the volume with this little speaker symbol. If you right click on it, you can see recording devices. And here we can see this is my real microphone and this is another microphone um, on, my, on my cam. And um, one issue might be that you have several microphones and your system is uh, picking up the one that's not so good. Maybe if you have a built-in microphone in your uh, laptop and you also have a headset microphone, uh, you might want to use the headset microphone. But anyways, you can kind of uh, tap the microphone and see which one is active. And I can see that this one is that one. And if I wanted to use this one, I would mark it and I would set it as default. Now I'm using this mic and that's the one that's default with a green symbol here that indicates the default one. Um, so make sure the microphone you want to use is the one that is set as default. If you need to increase the volume of the mic as is, you go to the microphone and you go to levels and you can now increase this bar here. Now 80 is good for this mic uh, and of course you can do this for the different microphones uh, that you use. Some microphones also use um, a boost. So there is another bar below this one that is called microphone boost or decibel boost or side tone. And you can take that and uh, increase that too. It will also increase the volume, the microphone you use output. Remember, however, that if you have too high output level of your microphone, uh, the people you are talking to will hear a loud background noise. So often you don't want it to 100%. It might be better to have it too close to 100, but not really, like I use 80 because if I use 100, you will always hear a slight background hiss from my computer. It will always pick up all the sound it can. It will basically be more sensitive. That's what that slider does. And if you don't see the microphone you're searching for here, make sure that if you right click here, make sure that show disabled devices and show disconnected devices are enabled because otherwise you won't see uh, some of those um, if uh, someone disabled it basically and I'm going to disable this because I don't want to use that microphone you can also do that to make sure that you also always use the right microphone now there is a third a little bit more advanced issue that uh, can occur if uh, you say all of these issues are no problem with them but uh, sometimes when you use certain programs like uh, Skype, Link for Business, um, Microsoft Teams or other software like Discord too can happen. Not so often, but most common is Skype and Skype for Business. Um, and that basically changes your sound levels in the Skype program uh, and makes it so that you are not audible and Skype is a little bit weird software. So what you might need to do to uh, work around this issue is right click the microphone you want to use, click properties, go to advanced and then you see here, allow applications to take exclusive control of this device and give exclusive mood applications priority. Uncheck these. Make sure these are unchecked then Skype and other such programs will um, will not be able to change the sound levels so you will be as audible as you have set in levels here. Yeah, 
Um, but only do this if you have problems with the program, not otherwise. It can be a nice feature to have, so yes. And then you just click apply, apply. And now I changed it back because I don't use Skype. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this little video. And if you did, you can, uh, well, subscribe to the channel for future videos and please like it too. You can also support the channel in the description if you would wish to. In any case, have a great day. This is Jim Odism, signing out.